the Gameltron, which is the world's first and we believe only fully robotic Indonesian gamelan orchestra. I lived in Indonesia for several years and I brought back a bunch of instruments with me. I was studying traditional gamelan music and then I started working with Eric Singer at the League of Electronic Musical Urban Robots and he specializes in robotizing unique exotic musical instruments. So we started this as a joint project with him sort of adapting his robots to be able to play Indonesian gamelan. So the flow is you have a MIDI signal that gets sent to a microprocessor and then a little electrical impulse goes out to this which is a solenoid electromagnet and essentially magnetizes this and inside this casing is a pin and that pin when the solenoid magnetizes pulls the pin up inside and it's attached to this lever and this lever is attached to this mallet so pin goes up mallet goes down this is the Padma Buana. It's a, a lotus flowered MIDI controller uh, made from replacement parts from 80s arcade uh, games. So these are arcade buttons and there's a Arduino, Arduino MIDI controller inside of it. So each button goes to the Arduino and the Arduino sends uh, MIDI messages to computer or to any kind of uh, MIDI processor and that can be used to trigger sequences of music. So this is kind of like the Gamelatron's iTunes where behind each button is a different composition. And this in itself is a mandala too, a Balinese mandala for the north, the south, and the east and the west. And each one of these colors correspond to what they kind of think cosmologically, uh, which color is in the north or in the south. And the compositions also correspond to that too because different tones live in the north and the south and the east and the west. So the compositions I store, let's say between, between the north or the south might be heavier in that tone that corresponds to it. 